What's up guys, it's Jackson Knight back with another video and today um, I decided to do a reptile collection video. Um, I don't have that many but I thought that it would be fun for you guys to just meet all my reptiles. So here we go. Okay, so my newest pet so far, it is a, it's actually really new. I think I got her like a month ago. Uh, probably not even a month, probably like three weeks. Um, it is a girl and it is a Tremper Albino Murphy's Patternless Leopard Gecko. She is very young. Um, I went to the pet store and I saw her and I know like it's not really good to get pets from like PetSmart or Petco or like those chain pet stores but I saw her I was like oh I have to have her she was I just I was in the market for a leopard gecko it's just I didn't know that PetSmart had one so yeah um here she is um I'll get some good shots of her in a little bit but she has a she has a white tail like a pure white tail and it's gorgeous she is in shed right now so she's not like as beautiful as she is once she's out of shed I will do a like full video of just her so yeah that is Luna my Tremper albino Murphy's patternless leopard gecko okay so kind of sticking in the spirit of leopard geckos I got my other leopard gecko. I have two, and this is my second one. Um, this was actually my first pet. Um, her name is, um, her name. Um, we were going to name her Luna, but then we thought that she was a boy, but then we figured out that she was finally a girl. So her name was Zeus, and we kind of just kept it that way. So this is Zeus. Um, my Tremper Albino Leopard Gecko, um, sorry for the brightness, you can kind of catch the pattern, yeah, that's a good shot, um, but yeah, that is her, yeah, that's a good shot for her, um, she, like I said, she's a Tremper Albino Leopard Gecko, yeah, she's really great, first pet. I definitely recommend leopard geckos. They're great pets. Okay, so the next animal on my list is actually a snake. Um, he is my only snake, and he is a yellow belly ball python. Um, I don't know here. Let me back up. So, so his head is over here. His tail's over here. He is a tiny bit over four feet long. He is a great animal to have. If you guys are in the market for a first snake, I definitely recommend a ball python. They kind of just sit on your neck. He is a bit more active than most ball pythons. Once he is out, he does like to move. Um, but that is kind of normal. Once snakes are out, they do like to move. But a lot of the times, they'll just stay on your neck. Like, I've cleaned the whole entire house once with him on my neck the whole entire time. It was great. And, like, one time I had to, like, loosen him up because he got a little bit scared. But, um, but that's it. They're great pets. Definitely would recommend them for beginners. And just a great pet to have. Um, he, I'm not sure how much he weighs. I will do a weighing video um, in the near future if you guys would like that. So if you would like that, definitely comment below and tell me. Um, but yeah, he's, um, he's a yellow belly ball python, and I got him from the, um, Portland Reptile Expo, um, this year. So, yeah, that's call. Okay, guys, this is my last reptile. You kind of just saw a glimpse of him here. He is a classic northern blue tongue skink he um i'm not sure how long he is but he is a, a, around a foot and a half that's how long he is um it's a really nice animal i definitely recommend them i wouldn't recommend them for beginners just because they're so hard to find and they're so expensive um it's I spent about $400 on him, um, 
because I bought him from Snakes at Sunset. Great place, by the way. Definitely am going to buy from them again. Um, and they, at the time, they were just really expensive. And I bought the last one at this price, and this is Phoenix. Um, the day after that, they went up to $400. Um, I did get him about at about 360 and shipping is about $40. Um, it, it was a great investment though. All of my animals I've paid for with my own money. I've saved up my own money for this except Ka. Um, but yeah, um, great animal. Definitely would recommend them. He is in shed right now so his colors aren't really as bright as they could be. The camera kind of shows it, um, his, his colors, but if, but if he's really just a really tan color right now and he gets pretty bright orange when you, when I do have him out. He's a great animal to have, definitely would recommend him, and that is my blue tongue skink. So yeah guys, that is all of my reptiles. I have four, one blue tongue skink one ball python and two leopard geckos. Um, I will be doing a weighing video if you guys would like that. Make sure to comment down below, like, subscribe, and always stay happy guys. See you next time.